This is Code.org. I'm currently working on their CS Principles course. I'm on Unit 3, Intro to Programming, Lesson 8, Creating Functions with Parameters, Part 19. So we have a multiple choice here. I'm a teacher. As a teacher, when you hit Submit on this, I get your answer. Well, if you're not my student, I don't get your answer. But make sure you think carefully about this, especially if you are my student. All right? So let's see. Choose 2, a function with parameters. Select the two true statements about functions with parameters. Parameters can only be used once within the body of a function. Functions with parameters can be used to prevent the creation of duplicate code. Parameters help generalize the solution of a specific problem. Values do not need to be provided to a function with parameters in any particular order. Okay. So let's go back and think about stuff we have run. Parameters can only be used once within the body of a function. Okay, so I'm going to go back and we're going to talk through this. Let's go to 14. If we look at our functions, uh, such as draw starfish and size, is size only used once, right? Because we set the size of our starfish when we do a function call up here draw starfish, we do a random number, or I did, between 20 and 90. So maybe it's 30. So, okay, size is 30. Then it goes down. Do I only use size once? No, I use size every move forward. Because for it to be a starfish, it needs equally, uh, it needs sides of in equal length. So I need to use size multiple times. So parameters can only be used once. Well, that's false. You can use them as many times as you want within your function. Okay? How about, how about values do not need to be provided to a function with a parameter, with parameters in any particular order? All right, well, let's look at stuff with multiple parameters then. So, size red, green, blue. Okay, size red, green, blue. If I need a starfish, let's say, I'm going to get rid of all of these random numbers. Just... So I need a fish, it, there's four parameters, and I need a, we're going to make that 40, I'm going to make this 255, so I have to have a red fish, we'll say. But ah uh, great, I have a red fish. Now, if I don't need to provide these parameters in any particular order, okay, so if I don't need to, well then I'm going to make this zero, and over here I'm going to put 255, because I need a red fish. Wait, I don't have a red fish. Parameters are in a particular order, right? When you create a function, when you make your function, parameters are in a very specific order. And they have to be. Um, because otherwise, it doesn't know what I mean, right? So when I make my function, I chose to have red, green, blue. So the second parameter is the blue parameter. I can't suddenly decide I'm going to put 255 for my fourth parameter and that should make my fish red, right? So no, they're in a very specific order. Now, what were the other ones? Functions with parameters can be used to prevent the creation of duplicate code. Hmm. Well, if this function was only, uh, let's go back to the starfish or the seaweed, it doesn't matter, but we'll say starfish. Draw starfish. Let's say we don't have a parameter. And instead of having size here, we have 60 for all of these, right? It's going to have 60, uh, 60 length for sides. Well, then if I need a 30 length side starfish, I need a whole new function. So being able to say, oh, let me just use a parameter. And then when I do my function call, I can ask for a certain size of starfish, right? That does eliminate duplicate code because I don't need one function for a starfish with 60 uh, length sides and one function for a starfish with 30. So functions with parameters can be used to cre to prevent the creation of duplicate code is, well, true. A parameter help generalize the solution of a specific problem. That's, I think, similar to what I just said. All right. So can I do parameters generalize my solution to specific problems? Well, let's think about that. If I specifically want a starfish with length of sides of 30, I can use my draw starfish function right, with 30 in for the size of the parameter, 
right? And if I want my, if I need a starfish with a specific size of 60 for the length of the sides, I can use my draw starfish and put 60 in. So notice I am using the draw starfish for two different, very specific things that I need, 30 and 60. So I can generalize. I can use it and apply it to all sorts of different types of scenarios. So parameters do help generalize uh, solutions to specific problems. Okay? So the two I just talked about, functions with parameters can be used to prevent the creation of duplicate code. Yep. Values, parameters help to generalize. Make sure you understand everything I just said. If you don't, go back and watch this again. It's going to be really difficult to move forward if you do not. But, uh, awesome. Let's keep going.